Patients often want to know what they can expect after surgery. Certainly, the results from surgery should be a 99% chance that that hernia won't come back. There is a 1% to 2% recurrence rate, which means at the end of every year or two or three, 1% to 2% of our patients will have that hernia come back. The actual recovery from hernia surgery, I break down into short-term recovery immediately after the surgery, and then longer-term recovery, which is the few weeks after surgery. So for the first three or four days after hernia surgery, I tell all my patients, don't plan any work or family activities. I simply want you at home, resting, icing down the area where we did the surgery, and letting that hernia heal. I don't want patients out taking long walks, going to family reunions, going back to work during those first few days. We don't want the swelling and the bruising to be worse than it is, and by staying at home and icing and relaxing, you can minimize your pain and minimize the amount of swelling. After the first three to four days, you transition into the more longer term recovery, which I say is about three weeks. Whether you have open or laparoscopic surgery, we tell you no heavy lifting for three weeks after your surgery. Nothing more than 10 or 20 pounds, which is a bag of groceries, a gallon of milk, a laptop, or a light briefcase. Patients want to know if they can get back to any cardiovascular activities during that time. And I say that during maybe the third week after your surgery, you can do some light biking, some light treadmill, some light jogging, but we don't want you straining and pushing yourself any harder than you have to. As we discussed in some of the previous videos, we usually use a mesh to reinforce the muscle. When we do that, it takes about three weeks for 90% of the strength of that mesh to form. So we want you to avoid lifting and straining any more than you have to during those three weeks to allow the strength of the hernia repair to set. After the three weeks, you're cleared to do almost anything you want to do. We encourage you to take it a little slow and incrementally work your way back up. I wouldn't go into the gym and do squats and deadlifts and bench press your first day back at day 22. We would just say slowly work your way back up from a light weight to a heavier weight and from some of the lighter exercises all the way back to what you were doing before the surgery. Ultimately, after that three week mark, you should be completely recovered. And after that, you'll be able to do everything that you were able to do before your surgery. There'll be no limitations on weights, no limitations on exercise, no limitations on any sort of cardiovascular exercises that you want to do. You're free to do anything you want to after those three weeks. So again, the first two or three to four days, we say stay at home, rest, recuperate, ice, for the following three weeks, we say take it easy, nothing more than 10 or 20 pounds, although you can return to light activities at home or at work. And then after the three week point, you're back to doing everything that you were doing before.